If you're fully ready for the Alex Math Placement Exam, well, this should be a very easy question to answer. All right, let's take a look at the problem. So we have a set of three points or a set of three x, y coordinates. All right, so each of these is an x, y ordered pair. In other words, we could graph these three points. But the question, in fact, is, is this a function? All right, so does this set of ordered pairs represent a function? All right, so this is a big topic in algebra and mathematics, and there's different ways to answer this. But I think the easiest way to answer this is to take a look at a mapping diagram. So this is how this works. We're going to put our x right here and our y's right here. So remember, x maps to y. So when we're looking at an ordered pair, an x, y ordered pair, the x variable is the independent variable. This represents the domain of a function, and the y variable represents the dependent variable, and this represents the range. So we can represent uh, these ordered pairs in a mapping diagram. So 1 maps to 3, 4 maps to 5, and then 1 over here maps to 5 as well. Okay, so one great way to uh, look at potential functions or relations in mathematics and to see if these relations are in fact functions is the following. Okay, so when we're looking at a mapping diagram, what we want to look to see is if each x maps to one and only one y. So one maps to only three, four maps to only five, but one is also mapping to five. Now you might be saying to yourself, is this a problem? Well, no, this is not a problem because this one is mapping to five. We would not actually write this mapping diagram in this manner. Okay, so that's what I meant to say. So one maps to three, but one is also mapping to five. So the way this will look like in this mapping diagram is one is going to three and one is also going to five. So this is not allowed in a function, all right? You cannot have one input value, one x, map to two output values, all right? So this is a relation and not a function. Okay, so if you need additional help for the math that you'll see on the Alex Math Placement Exam, check out the link in the description and the comment section.